welcome back to another video on the channel now today i said it last week it is boiling hot so if you slowly see me get redder and my hair gets a bit more wet it's because it is absolutely boiling here in wales so you just have to excuse that and today we've got quite a big video as we are going to be talking about the turnover of the 22-23 season for Exum FC. Before we get into the video, I would love to know where you're watching this video from across the world. I've done it before and I absolutely loved reading all the replies. So get in the comments section down below. Let me know where you're watching from around the world. I'm gonna enjoy reading those comments down below. I've had to move the camera as well a bit because it is so bright outside. But yeah, enough of the waffle. Let's get talking about Wrexham. If you are new, make sure to get down there, click the red subscribe button for all the best Wrexham AFC content on YouTube and let's get talking about this big topic that is the Rex FC turnover of 22-23. So Fleur Robinson attended Bolsworth International event yesterday where she was asked about the turnover of Wrexham Football Club and she revealed that the club's turnover has increased 700% over the past 24 months. So in comparison to our turnover of the 21-22 season where it was 5.97 million which is obviously made up of the match day income, the ticket sales, the retail income, sponsorships, advertisements, etc. But regards to this season, there was a drastic change in the income increase, and it hasn't come from any of the listed above. But there's one major driver that wasn't included in last year's document, and that was the Welcome to Wrexham docuseries. Now, a lot of people have wanted an estimate as to how much Wrexham AFC have made from this documentary, and if I'm being honest, I think this is the closest closest we will get to knowing how much it is actually made because obviously compared to last year's turnover it was 5.97 million compared to this year's where it's 20 million we can get the indication that the welcome to Wrexham profits have made up a large chunk of this year's turnover obviously welcome to Wrexham was a global hit and it helped the club grow significantly since it was aired leading to millions of social media followers a drastic drastic increase in the shirt sales and a drastic demand for match day tickets with our home and away tickets whether it be at the racecourse ground or whether it be at Aldershot Town we sell out every week we sold out I would say 99% of away games last year and 100% home games so it was clear to see that the Welcome to Wrexham documentary had a huge effect on the town of Wrexham and an even bigger effect on the football club. Now obviously we can talk about Welcome to Wrexham having the main driver as the turnover and the profit for this season but there's these additional sectors that obviously did play a huge part in that turnover increase and they were obviously the revenue from the National League streaming service that did come into place halfway through the National League 22-23 season. We obviously saw an increase in the ticket sales obviously last season 21-22 I'm referring to. We sold out a fair few home games but I wouldn't say we sold out every home game but compared to last season our promotion season 100% of home games are sold out and our away following got even larger and obviously one of the main factors is the retail the demand for the shirts since the documentary have come out have been through the roof and it has been incredible to see now last year we sold 24,000 shirts so that is going to play a huge huge role in the turnover this season and think what it will be like in the 23-24 season we've ordered 35,000 of stock of the home away in third shirts and if I'm being honest we are going to sell out that so could next year's turnover be even higher let me know in the comment section down below but I think we can sort of gather that the welcome to Wrexham documentary was the main pull power and was the main reason why our turnover has gone from 5.97 million to 20 million in just 12 months and if we're comparing it to the 21 turnover of just above 1.7 million compared to 23 which is 20 million pound that is absolutely huge that is a significant growth in income and yeah the welcome to action documentary is all down to that 700 percent increase in robin ryan's first you could say full season but it wasn't really a full season their first season involved with Wrexham football club in 2021 that was obviously a season to forget missing out on playoffs and obviously it was played behind closed doors for the majority of the season from that 2021 season to the 22-23 season we have seen a 1,251% increase in turnover which I 
genuinely don't think that's ever happened to a club maybe outside the championship in the history of football and then everyone wants to know as well where did we actually lose money this season where can we expect to see us losing money obviously the main one being the wage bill obviously that's part and parcel of wanting to go up and having this takeover you're going to be spending more on players you're going to be offering them higher wages and i think the wage bill will equate to around 2.8 million this season it was 2.5 million a couple of seasons ago but i think obviously with the signings of barnett o'connell tony cliff they're going to be on a bit higher wages and which will obviously add on to the 2.5 million another factor will be the expenditure of players obviously we signed the likes of ryan barnett owen o'connell jacob mendy just to name a few obviously the expenditure of players would be high this season obviously it won't be as much as we spent in the 21-22 season where obviously we spent 1.2 million i think we're not looking at that type of transfer fee because obviously jacob mendy ryan barnett were all from this level so you're not expecting us to pay high six figure fees for these players so obviously that was smart business there but of course these figures can continue to be fine as long as we are making enough income and if we're financially stable so yeah that is what fleur robinson did say yesterday i think it's crazy it's a crazy times we were and i think i've said that saying a hundred times in videos before but it genuinely is if you just said maybe six years ago that our turnover would be 20 million pound in a season i'd have probably laughed in your face but you know we're all on this journey together it's exciting we're back in the football league i mean what a time to be a wrexham fan and obviously yeah 2013 winning the FA Trophy. That was the last good memory I have before we obviously gained promotion this season. So it's been that long. We've had seasons of failure. We've had seasons of disappointment. But yeah, we're finally back. We've got that promotion and we're back where we belong. So yeah, a huge well done to everyone involved who was able to get this turnover to an incredible fee of £20 million. So yeah, like I said, retail services, all of that stuff, the home away third shirts last year, obviously sold out really, really well. And obviously a well done to everyone who turns up every week. Obviously the demand for tickets are really high at the minute. And then that's another thing that you've got to factor in. The cop, when the cop does come in, will probably sell all the tickets in there. The match day tickets income will be absolutely incredibly high. So yeah, I mean, exciting times ahead for Wrexham and yeah, the future is bright for us. I just do want to say as well, a huge congratulations to Super Paul Mullin and Ben Tosa for getting in the FA Cup team of the season. They're accompanied by the likes of Casemiro, Mitoma, John Stones, Riyad Mahrez. So, I mean, that was a great achievement. We had a great FA Cup run. Paul Mullin obviously winning the FA Cup Golden Ball and Ben Tosa being the rock at the back as he always is so yeah a huge round of applause to them and then for myself obviously we hit 18k overnight i cannot thank you enough for that we are that close now it's in sight 20 000 subscribers is around the corner i mean if we could hit that before the start of the season what a start to the season that would be but i take 19k you've smashed the support and yeah subscribe if you're new watching this we can hit 20k before the start of the season with all the content that is going to be coming out over the summer so yeah don't miss out hit the red subscribe button now and that is it from me i hope you enjoyed up the town it's a great time to be a wrexham fan and i'll see you in the next video take care everyone